Let's, let's find out what's happening in Melbourne with uh, Port Adelaide. Now, if you're a Port fan, RAA Travel have the best Port Adelaide Footy Club 2019 Shanghai packages starting from $929. That's a good deal. That is brilliant. Including China entry visa. Now, they're tricky to get. So make oh, yeah. Sure. Uh, see the RAA website for more details. Matthew Locken, the coach of the Port Adelaide Magpies, but he's also over there in an assistant coaching role with the power. Matty, how are you? Good, thanks, guys. How are you? Oh, you're a bit... Good, low. Matty. Volume's a bit low there. Matty, how's that? You got me? Yeah. Oh, we, brilliant. Clear as a whistle. Um, how is it? How's it look? Did that, yeah, well, look, it's, be- uh, it's exciting. It's... Uh, Friday night footy, and um, we're here in Melbourne, and uh, we're just about to jump on the team bus. And um, yeah, look, it's exciting—an opportunity for us to be able to play, you know, one of the best sides in the competition. And they certainly are. Do you get a chance to train on that that stadium, Marvel Stadium or Dockland Stadium? No, we don't. We had our captain's run before we jumped on the plane yesterday, and um, the boys go for a, a light jog this morning. But no, we don't train on um, Marvel Stadium. Locks, um, talk us through the Carl Amon selection over the top of Stevie Motlop. Um, oh, look, both have been in pretty um, good form in the sample over the last couple of weeks, I guess. Um, you know, we thought he was down to more positional. I think, you know, we probably needed an extra winger um, in our side. For this week against Collingwood, obviously they've got some a lot of guys that rotate through their midfield and through their wings. So we thought um, Carl was the right person to take into this game this week. Now, you're the coach of the Maggies. Jack Trengove can do no more. Where's he in the selector's eyes? I guess that's probably um, the good thing of where we're at at the moment. We've probably got, um, you know, half a dozen to sort of 10 guys in the sample that are playing really good footy and putting their hand up. Um, obviously, we, we lost Robbie out of the AFL side um, last week with his hand. So um, I think those guys in the sample have just sort of got to buy their, t- buy their time and, and wait for their opportunity. And, and when they do, they're ready to go because they're in good form. There's a player last year I looked at and thought he had a great future. He looked to, to have everything a, an AFL player needs. He, he seemed to be quick, good left foot kick, covered the ground well, penetrated. And that's Kane Farrell. Where's, where's he at? Um, he's been playing some consistent footy in the sample. Um, I think with the, the first year guys that have come in and playing a similar role to Kane's probably just pushed him out of the side. So um, he probably played his best game for the year on the weekend against against the Eagles or Woodrest Torrens. And um, he's not too far away from playing our AFL footy. He's probably, like I said before, just got to wait his time. So much talent in that Collingwood midfield. Uh, oh, yeah. Are you going head-to-head or do you have... Um tagging roles? Oh, look, probably a little bit of both. I think it, we, I don't think we'll go the traditional tag, but you've certainly got to be accountable for for one, if not two of those guys. Um, you know, as you mentioned, they're a quality midfield. Um, you know, they've got Sidebottom, Pendlebury, Truor, Beams. Um, that's only to name a few. And obviously Grundy in the ruck. So, um, if we don't tag as such, we'll certainly have to be accountable because we can't let them off the chain through that middle of the ground. Grundy is such a dominant player. That, you know, he'd be first pick in most coaches' eyes. How are you going to counter him? Yeah, well, look, we think we've got a pretty good combination in the ruck as well with Paddy and, and Scotty are in um, pretty good form as a duo. So, look, we won't... Um, we know that he's a good player and we know that he's going to win win some hit-outs and give them first look at it. So um, we just expect those those two guys to compete. Um, and then from there, you know, Scotty Lysett's around groundwork is, is as good as anyone and we know that Paddy can get forward and kick a goal. So, um, you know, although he's a, a really good player, uh, we certainly think we've got a couple of guys that are pretty handy in that area as well. And just a word quickly on Travis Bokes, 250th. Uh, look, Bokey's one of the most professional players that I've seen in my involvement in footy. Um, the way he prepares himself to play each week, um, not only throughout the season, but over pre-season is first class. So um, he's been a great of, of Port Adelaide. And I, I heard you mention before, is he the best midfielder to ever play for Port Adelaide? He'll have to be very close. Yeah. He's an outstanding player and had a really good year. Well done, mate. All the best. Port Maggie's coach and power assistant, Maddie Locken there. Um, Maggie's and Port live on 5AA from 6. Wilds, Timmy G and Treaders. It's at Marvin. And I cannot wait. Thanks, Maddie. All the best, mate. Now, uh, if you're a Port fan, you'd be tempted to do this. Book your Port Adelaide I've footy club. I've done it. Club. It's brilliant. You've booked. You've done it. No, well, we went two years ago. I've been and done well, it. I'm... It is brilliant.
The 2019 Shanghai package with RAA Travel starts from just $929, including China entry visa. Book yours at raa.com.au.